the FIFA 2018 World Cup in Russia will undoubtedly grab the attention of the world. Here in T. The Pro League is very important to a lot of young men like myself, said winger Joe Moule Francois. It's an opportunity to be positive and stay away from negative even when you have little to nothing. For most of us it's a chance to train professionally and for exposure towards better opportunities such as the national team and hopefully to move our careers abroad to earn a better living for ourselves and our families. No other level of football in the country gives us this opportunity. Francois, 22, and his girlfriend April Gooding will welcome their first child in August, a girl he says. But a third female will also be anchored in his heart every time he takes to the field this season. My mother, said the former St. Anthony's College student and footballer. Francois' mother passed away on February 27th of this year. And while it stands the biggest loss in his life, Keisha Francois will be his inspiration to press on. This season will be dedicated to her, vowed the former Northeast Stars winger who has made a switch to San Juan Yablada for the upcoming 2018 season. Francois' new club will not be in action on the opening day, June 1st. His former club and defending Pro League champions Northeast Stars would, when they tackle W Connection, first Citizens Cup champions of last season, in the 2018 curtain-raising charity Shield. Connection were in fact one of the earliest teams to kick off pre-season despite uncertainties over the start of the new domestic season. And the Savonetta boys had not allowed the lengthy wait to detract from ambitions, according to Longstanding's technical director, head coach Stuart Charles Fevrier. It has been business as usual said the Longstanding connection coach. And we will always be interested in the business side of football, that's the priority. But although known for their business side and the export of players, Favrier said the Savonetta boys have not escaped financial challenges and are forced to operate on a minimal group of players. Despite this, Favrier believes the existence of the pro league and top flight clubs remains beneficial to T. Iceland now holds the record after booking their place at Russia 2018. Professional football is important if we T. Since the commencement of the professional league, we, T. We must keep pushing on, without the pro league it's obvious we'd go backwards. At Connection, we focus on improving the players, doing our part and providing better opportunities for the players but they must then take the chance to secure themselves abroad. They can benefit and the club Connection can also benefit. That doesn't mean we don't focus on winning titles too. We will always prepare to try and win everything that we compete in, but to remain relevant as a professional club you also have to focus on the business side of football. Fevry, the most successful coach of the Pro League era, admitted that the long wait for the new domestic season has been frustrating for his players. It's a little frustrating for our players because they have been training for the past two months and haven't had football to play, he stressed. But once the season commences they would be happy. Defense Force FC head coach Marvin Gordon echoed similar feelings. It affected the players mentally not knowing when the start would come, he said. But now there is a date and they are at a better frame of mind knowing it's a month away. Gordon, whose side began preparations in February, did however stress that he and his trainers were forced to alter the training program at times because we didn't want the players to peak too early. Judging from Francois' anxious feelings over the new season, defense force promising some exciting new players, and the registration window closing on May 14th, it's indeed interesting times ahead.